morning. It's an early start for me because uh, in an hour and 50 minutes, I'm on morning television. That feeling when the gym is all yours. Ooh. It's a bit too early to be at this bright. All right, it's eight in the morning. I'm feeling quite fresh. I'm glad I, I set an alarm to get up nice and early and go to the gym, have my shower and all that stuff. Not just to try and feel as fresh and awake as possible, but also to counteract the fact that I was up till two in the morning <laughs> finishing up a video. I'm really excited about this one. This is gonna go live in literally one minute, uh, which is something I'm very excited about. This is a collab with the folks over at Punish Props, and it's one that some of you, along with me, have been very excited to see come out for months now uh, because they've built me a superhero costume and they'll be releasing their build and I'll be releasing my design and this is only the first half of the collab. The second half, which is uh, going to be me wearing the costume and, and having fun with it and then releasing their putting the lights together, the straps, painting, all that stuff uh, will come down later down the line when they finish that up. But it's very exciting. So go check it out on the channel because it'll be out by the time you see this vlog. Um, otherwise, that's it for me in here. I've got to pack up. I've got to, I've got to Uber over to Channel 7 Studios and Docklands uh, and get ready for my, my interviewee thing. So yeah, should be fun. Hopefully I don't fall on my face. Good morning. How you going? Uh, I'm signing in. I'm on this morning on the morning show. Just, just That's me, yeah. Hey look, it's the preview for my spot. That's awesome! <laughs> this is my little booth. They're gonna be, uh, the hosts are actually in Sydney. So I believe it'll be like a split screen and they'll talk to me and I'll be sitting there pretending to be in front of the, <laughs> in front of the Melbourne River, the, the Yarra. Good fun. Ooh, I guess this is what it looks like. Your volume control is just on the right hand side there. Great. <coughs> Where you want to be looking is straight down the camera here. Yep. Um, one of the producers will speak to you via your IFB before you're due to go on mm -hmm. and give you a little bit of a heads up before you get started. And otherwise, that's pretty much it. Thank you very much. Cool. I'll be on here every evening. Great. Thanks. It's absolutely mind blowing. I, I guess I saw that there was potential. It was a it was a growing industry, and I and I saw I had something to offer, and I tried my best, and and yeah, it's it's definitely exceeded my expectations. It's very exciting. Oh, gee, that, they range from like 7 to 70. It's really interesting. We actually get emails from hundreds of people every day uh, sharing their stories with us. And, and that's one of the mm. No one told me to disconnect, so... I've just disconnected myself from that. Don't know if I'm not supposed to do that. Now it's not every day you're in a in a little uh, comms booth for a TV studio, so let's have a little explore here. They have a uh, a live feed of the show on the top monitor, and on the bottom is a live feed of this room. And then we have the TV there. So I was looking in the camera with the lights. I'm particularly impressed by the acoustics of this room. They've got nice acoustic paneling all throughout, controlled lighting. I just enjoy the techie stuff, really. <laughs> I look at all their stuff and I'm like, oh, these are really cool lights. I'd love something like that. Jesus, look at that thing. I'm a, I'm a much smaller outfit than Channel 7. I like those big chunky pieces of tech, but you know what, my little uh, my little Samsung phone does pretty all right. I think I'm, I think I'm supposed to leave. Oh, how you going? 
That was fun. Thank you so much for having me. Cool, no problem. Thanks for being here. No worries. Hope you don't mind me filming the whole time while I'm being no, filmed. No. <laughs> right. Now we walked past this on the way in. That is very impressive. All of a sudden my monitors and work desk don't look that impressive. I wonder what Mrs. Jazza would think if I suggested something more like this. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. It's a, it's a really interesting experience to see how how a big well-oiled machine like Channel 7 runs, you know. Anyways, that was this morning. That was uh, what I came down here for. So I'm going to catch the train home and just do a bit of work on my laptop on the way. Alright, so uh, I finished up just in time to miss a train home. <laughs> so rather than catching a train that left five minutes ago, I'm gonna have to wait an hour and a half. So I'm just having breakfast, crack open the laptop, check some emails, go do uh, comment replying and check out what you guys are saying about the collab. I can't wait to see what you guys think. This has been fun. Now comes the quiet bit. That is pretty much the main interesting part of today done. Well, at least for you guys. I'm gonna I'm gonna take a weekend and uh, and relax a bit. So it's midday Saturday. I haven't lost too much of the weekend. I'm just gonna he gonna head home and uh, relax with Mrs. Jazza and MJ. But in the meantime, I thought you might enjoy seeing the what the segment looked like. So I'll just pop it in at the end of this vlog. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'll see you next week. Upon further consideration, I realised that I don't really own the copyright of the interview that happened on Channel 7. So, instead, I'll put a link in the description and pin a tweet, uh, pin a comment uh, with a link to a tweet that Sunrise put out with the full footage of the interview. So you can go check it out. Make sure to go like and retweet or whatever to, to show your love. In the meantime, I've got to I've got to go read Cat and Hat comes back for the. 5,000th time maybe uh, uh, we uh, love this book uh, uh, say no night no night no. kiss Australian who has turned his passion for art into a booming YouTube career. Desire Brooks goes by the name of Jazza and his YouTube channel, Draw With Jazza, has more than 3 million subscribers. Wow. So, so good. Jazza uses everything to create his works of art from pencil to pens to...